All right, today I'm going to finish a sitting bowl, or at least get them to a point where I can get a good idea what it's going to cost to produce it. Now the clay I'm going to be using isn't the same clay because I don't have that clay left. So I'm going to have to uh, use some gray clay. And uh, I'm going to borrow some round clay from the uh, front part or the back part to. Uh, do any work that I need to do on the front part. A good size piece right there I can take off. I started this guy about a year ago, I think. Wasn't much more than a year ago. And it was in my studio that I, my old studio, that I started it in. There's a picture of a uh, sitting bull standing in front of the crowd by himself, wrapped in a blanket and uh, holding his uh, hat with the uh, butterfly on uh, the hat band uh, in front of him like this. And so that's what gave me the idea for this uh, particular sculpture. Kind of unusual to see a sculpture of sitting bull without a you know feather straight up in the air but i didn't want to do a portrait of him like all the other portraits i wanted to make it a little bit more unique
push this clay up in here because there's a hole that goes right through the back and I want to make sure that's all filled in. I really like this uh, terracotta colored clay. I've got more of it, but I just don't know where it is. I've packed it away and haven't done packed the box yet that had it in it, so I'll find it eventually. It's a nice little sculpture of a sitting bull. Okay, this is where I'm going to use my gray clip now. It won't make any difference once it's cast in bronze it'll all be the same color I'll sign this one. Copyright. And the addition of 40. Okay. Sitting bowl is done. Well, 
Till next time. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right. See you next time.